Hi guys, Sai is here back with another interesting and most important video and today in this video I am going to talk about how to install latest Android version custom ROMs on Redmi Note 7 Pro device. Yeah guys, in this video I am going to cover full step by step process, how to download file, how to install custom ROMs, everything I will explain in this video in detail depth. So watch this video till the end and if you are new on this channel then don't forget to subscribe also join our telegram channel where I provide important files and updates. So without any wasting of time let's begin. Okay before move on the process first thing which you need to note that you need to unlock your device bootloader. If you don't know how to unlock Xiaomi Redmi Poco device bootloader, I will already made one video on this topic. So I will provide link on description. So check that video, complete the process. Okay, then came on this video. Okay, so let's talk about the process. So first of all, uh, you need to install Telegram application on your device. Okay, on your any device and login Telegram. Now you need to join telegram group and update channel of redmi note 7 pro i will give link on description of this channel so you will get all the roms recoveries and other files on this channel so for example purpose here it is a lot of roms is present so i am going to install this durfeast latest standard version rom which i like this is my favorite rom which is durfeast os okay so here it is all the things are mentioned here as we can see download link flashing guide recovery all the things you will get here okay for example purpose i'm going to download uh, this derfeast os rom here it is direct link also present okay let's talk about flashing guide so it's very mandatory process first of all you know to need that follow this flashing guide so go through this flashing guide as we can see here it is uh, in flashing guide uh, they said uh, it supports dynamic uh, custom recovery so we need to download dynamic custom recovery then which uh, think we need to wipe on recovery section all the things mentioned here read this flashing guide properly okay after that you are good to go to install this rom i will show how to install this rom but Still, if you're going to install any ROM, better you first read flashing guide. Okay, after that, the file which mentioned to install before you're going to install ROM, which is custom recovery. Absolutely, custom recovery which we are going to use, which is uh, Orange Fox recovery. So, download Orange Fox recovery and custom ROM. And if you want to uh, decrypt your device then you need to download DFE version that file is also present in flashing guide but it's a um, optional file if you want to flash DFE then your device will be decrypt if you don't flash then it is in encrypted form so depends on you if you don't know what is decryption then you need to follow or you need to watch my how to decrypt any Android phone video I mean that video you will get information about what is decryption so i will provide that video link on description also okay let's talk about the process first of all download files on pc or if you don't have pc then you can download file on your another phone as a we need to use as a computer phone to flash custom recovery on our uh, redmi note 7 pro so here it is i extract the redmi note 7 pro orange fox recovery okay after extract that recovery we need to copy paste that recovery on our platform tools folder plat uh, i will provide link on description of this platform uh, tool zip you need to download the zip extract it then you will get folder after that that recovery which you are extracted from orange fox zip that recovery paste on this uh, extracted platform tools folder after that you need to open the command window and flash custom recovery if you don't know how to flash custom recovery through another phone i already made one video so you can watch that video also i will provide link on description okay now boot your device on fast boot mode how can you boot just simply tab on reboot when it's going to reboot press volume down key only until the fast boot logo is games like fast boot name or me bunny logo is games like that so this logo is games then you are then you can leave that volume down key okay after that connect your device with data cable with your pc and now click on here uh, type cmd and hit enter then command window will be opened in command window first of all check your device is connected or not for that the command is fast boot space uh, devices then hit enter then your device will be show on command window now i am directly going to flash recovery the command is fast boot space flash space recovery space drag and drop the extracted recovery 
uh, I will show you it. Simply drag and drop that recovery. So here it is the recovery. Just drag and drop this recovery on this command window, then hit enter. After that, that recovery is installed on our device successfully. When it says uh, finished total time, some time is uh, showing. That means the recovery installed successfully. Now boot on recovery. How can you boot? Hold the power button. When screen is turned off, then uh, press the volume up button and leave power button. Okay, as you can see, I do this thing. As we can see, don't leave volume up button until custom recovery. That means orange fox recovery is not open. So as you can see, the orange fox recovery is open. Now you can leave the volume up button. Now let's talk about installation process. As you can see, here it is some XYZ things is showing. Now go on this uh, delete box. Uh, if touch is not working, then turn off screen and turn on screen. Then go on wipe section, then go on uh, format data section, type YES and click on right button on keyboard. So it will do format data. Okay, download file in SD card or pen drive or in, P in PC because you need to do format data of your device now. That's why. After done format data, click on reboot, click on recovery. Okay, when you click on recovery, then after some time the recovery will open. Okay, as we can see the recovery is reopened. Now, we need to copy paste that files, which files Rome right now, Durfee Rome. Yeah. Latest standard version Durfee Rome. Copy that file on your, uh, internal storage of your device. If you have pen drive or SD card, you can paste on it. So I are directly pasting on my internal storage of my device. So in download section, I already download this Durfee file. Here it is the Durfeast file. So I am only fl going to flash Durfeast file in encrypted form. So I am not uh, uh, copy another file which is a DFE file, right? So this is a DFE file. Yeah. If you want to install DFE, if you want to decrypt your device, then you can also copy paste this DFE file on your internal storage of your device. Okay, I forward the video. Now both files are successfully pasted on internal storage of our device, our Redmi Note 7 Pro device. Okay, unlock it. Now what is next step? Okay, now came on this wipe section, then check the boxes which I am selecting. And one more box you need to check that is data. On bottom, uh, bottom, bottom second number that is data. Check that box if you are in uh, decrypted user. It's mandatory to check that last uh, bottom second box I am not selected but you need to select it okay I am ignore it but you don't ignore that box okay three boxes you need to select what that Dalvik cache then catch then data after wipe that boxes came on installation section and first select ROM then second select DFE then swipe this it will take a little bit of time to install wait until it says successful installed successful successful message will be came on top bar as we can see installation is completing near to near okay done it's successful as we can see on top successful is came now just you need to click on a reboot system or you can wipe the catcher then click on reboot system okay then your device will boot in few seconds If you are facing any issue like your device is not going to boot or it appears on black screen or again it's uh, going on recovery. If this type of issues is came, na, just do format data and click on reboot, which I previously show you now how to do format data. Just type YES, then click on right button. That's it. Then click on reboot system. Okay. Then all the issues will be resolved. Now I am going to set up rapidly then i will show you
okay device setup is done now I'm going to open settings and here it is the about section and as we can see here it is this Durfist OS ROM based on Android 16 latest Android version 16 so like that you can install any latest Android 16 custom ROM so if you like this video then please like and share this video see you in the next video love you guys goodbye take care